so sorry about that, Leo. My phone rang. I'm filming on my phone now because my laptop is kaput. I have to take it in. So anyway, um, right. So Wheel of Fortune reversed, all right, in your present energy. Um, feeling like you've put a lot of hard work and effort into something and you're waiting for it to come to fruition for you and feeling like it's just not ever going to happen, all right? For some of you guys, it may not happen. If you're investing too much time, energy, or effort into a crappy job, a crappy relationship, whatever the case may be in your life that you're putting all this effort into and it's just like stagnant, you know, um, some of you guys may be deciding this month to give up on that or to move forward into something else, all right? Six of Pentacles in your near future. Why is the Six of Pentacles in your near future? Some of you guys are entering into a new relationship, possibly another fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, but seriously moving forward into a situation or relationship that is equal give and take, that is balanced and that is structured, okay? They're making a plan, plan of attack, you know, this is like sitting down with your partner and going, okay, we're going to pay this bill off this month and that bill off next month and, you know, moving forward in that way. Um, but it's also somebody coming into your life that truly is going to be giving you a lot, okay? Um, and they're going to be giving you as much as you give them. So make sure that if you find somebody really cool like that, that's a very giving person, you dedicate time and effort to them this month. Um, because if you do, it's going to pay off for you big time in the long run. You're going to have a lifelong friend or even a new romantic partner, okay? Seven of Wands. Why is Seven of Wands here? Why does Leo feel attacked? Seven of Wands. Okay. Five of Pentacles. So somebody may have left you out in the cold, all right? Um, emotionally or financially, all right? You may have to really go to bat for this. Some of you guys, you could be even going to court, suing somebody in small claims court. Um, others of you, it could be like you um, are fighting off bill collectors, okay? This can be a card of uh, poverty. You're not having enough to make ends meet, all right? Maybe you're fighting really hard to get out of debt. I don't know why that's coming up a lot for, for me, for Leo right now, but, you know, I feel like there's a big shift in your financial uh kind of like aspects this month like you're you're really looking towards if you know a bright future kind of setting yourself up for this like king of pentacles ten of pentacles type of energy some of you guys are really going to be seeking abundance um you know over anything else going forward like making very smart financial decisions why is the nine of wands here yeah it's a king of wands so that could be you leo or another air sign or another fire sign uh Sagittarius or Aries, okay? Um, but again, you could be feeling a bit attacked. A King of Wands can be, again, though, with that Nine of Wands, you standing up for yourself, you taking charge of the situation, all right? Being in control. Why is the Three of Swords here for Leo? Clarity, confusion, and Queen of Swords, Air Sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So you're getting clarity about something, guys, and it could be that somebody has been with the Queen of Swords reversed. You could either be healing, realizing that this person wasn't good for you, okay? Um, this person is very cruel in communication. She's a lot of times um, very sneaky and manipulative, so you may have had somebody manipulating the crap out of you that broke your heart, okay? But you're going to see through that, and you're going to be able to heal and move forward. So very good energy there um, for you guys. Others of you, it could be a water sign or an air sign that broke your heart, and again, you're you're receiving clarity so that you can move forward positively into the new, you know, new cycle here. All right, let's pull some oracle cards for Leo. Leo, Leo, July 2018, rest of July 2018. What does Leo need to know? Ooh, denial, card number 14. Okay, let's read it. All right, what do we got here for Leo? It says, Cons uh, consider the wait for your highest good. You are not meant to achieve what you want right now. Keep the faith. If you wait and show patience, I will reveal some wondrous things later. This is the gentle warning not to get caught up in your desire to reach your goal too soon. You may choose sour fruit that only looks ripe and juicy. In this case, I know alone when my time is ripe. Patience, my child. All right, so be patient, Leo. Like I said, a lot of you guys don't have all the facts yet. You really don't. So just you know, don't make any hasty decisions. Have patience, all right? Rejection is the universe's protection sometimes, for real. All right, love card for Leo for the rest of July 2018. Love card for Leo. Playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. So cute, all right? Um, so again, 
try not to take everything so seriously this month. If you meet somebody, lighthearted energy. If you're in a committed relationship, again, maybe it's time for you guys to go do something really fun to kind of get your spirits back up, okay? All right, my Leo friends. Again, if you're interested in a personal reading, I can be reached at trustandtruthtarot at gmail.com. Um, once again, thank you so much for watching, liking, subscribing, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.